Hello all you lovely birders, I hope you're doing well. I wanted to take the time to make a video on a few great things the simple and easy act of birdwatching can do for people on a deeper level, helping to ground us and give us a better, more calm state of mind. Maybe many of you experienced some of what I'm going to go over since taking up your birdwatching hobby, and maybe some of you haven't yet. Whatever the case, I hope to help you tap into this wonderful way of being and really deepen your experience. Here are a few things birdwatching can do for you. Being more mindful. Mindfulness is one of the most important things a human can learn to do, and you do not need to sit in quiet meditation to practice this technique. The whole point of mindfulness is to bring your focus and concentration to what is happening in the here and now without judgment, just observing. While watching birds, it is very easy to focus on them. It's an engaging activity that is rooted in curiosity. By describing to yourself what you are seeing, the color, shape, size, or what the bird is doing, just the straight facts, no story or narrative, you are participating in mindfulness. Even if you are waiting to see a bird, you can pay attention to what you are hearing, smelling, and seeing around you. There is so much to behold while out in nature. Bringing a calm and focus to the moment as you experience the outdoors and practicing this every time can trickle down into other parts of your life, making your ability to manage emotions and lessen any anxieties or depression easier. You may even begin to notice that the simplest things you've overlooked before now have your appreciation. The saying, it's the small things in life, holds a strong truth. So watching birds is a great door into mindfulness, where the practice of non-judgment, patience, openness, and acceptance can become a large part of your experience in life. Being fully present in the moment. In times of panic and stress, we think too much. A gazillion thoughts can come flooding our minds, leaving us very overwhelmed and thinking about the past or the future. Often we obsess over a project we need to finish or the disagreement we had with a friend, spouse, or family member. When we are caught by the thoughts rummaging around in our minds, we feel terrible and lose out on the moment. When this happens, taking some time to watch the birds in your yard or a local park will bring you into the present moment. You can't focus on two thoughts at once. Observing our feathered friends, really taking notice of the feathers, or watching a bird as it flies, paying attention to the wing beats, will draw your focus away from the problems you are having. For this reason, many people find they are at peace while watching birds. As Lao Tzu once said, if you are depressed, you are living in the past. If you are anxious, you are living in the future. If you are at peace, you are living in the present. Often in my experience, these calm present moments bring me one of two things. Either I learn to accept what I cannot change or control, or I find a clear solution to something I've been struggling with. A great spiritual quote I like is, quiet the mind and the soul will speak. There is no doubt that the mind has its place, but sometimes it is the deepness within, devoid of all the crazy talk, which has the wisest answers. And watching birds helps to tap us into this realm of possibility. Helps you to connect with nature. This is one last important thing bird watching does to make us feel good. Birds are the easiest and most abundant animal to see so close to us, our homes, neighborhoods, parks, and cities. They are everywhere, as long as there are some trees and water. As we go about each day, stuck in our office, or cooped up in our homes during winter, it is easy to lose connectedness with nature. However, something as simple as putting a bird feeder outside your kitchen or office window, if possible, can bring in a variety of birds, even in winter. People are often unaware of just how fruitful bird watching is. Taking time out of your day to watch the birds from your window can help you get back in touch with nature. It can also be a great way to start the day off. Even better if you can get out for 20 minutes or so for a walk while you watch birds. Connecting with nature is beneficial to our mind, body, and soul. Those are a few things that bird watching can do for people and are big factors for why it's such a healthy hobby for the mind. How fortunate we are to exist in a world where birds live. 
The next time a robin, chickadee, or crow ends up in your field of vision, let it be a reminder of the importance to stop for a moment, no matter how busy, to realign yourself by observing the bird in your sight. It's not always about getting the picture either. Sometimes you need to put down the camera or cell phone and just take in what's there with your eyes. Some of my most memorable bird watching moments occurred without using my camera. I'm interested to hear from you. Has bird watching helped you to have a better state of mind? With spring at its peak, take a day to yourself to connect with nature and enjoy the birds in your yard or local park while practicing the technique of mindfulness and being present. I really hope that this helps you. Thank you all so much for watching. Happy spring birding!